Hello YouTube, what is it guys? Nonstop RC here and today I got in front of me a uh, Stampede 4x4. Now this baby right here is built the right way. So uh, it's actually the name of the video. So out of the box, Stampede 4x4 is really awesome. It's cool. And uh, that's about basically how we got his box stock. And um, we did get it however used, but it was box stock and it was basically brand new. So we get to play around with it, brand new for a little bit, and uh, we noticed some major issues on um, this car had that were pretty easy fixes, actually. And uh, one being the tires. As you can see, this thing is outfitted with Pro-Line Master tires, some BA looking monster truck tires, got a lot of grip, nice and soft. Uh, these are a thousand times better than these stock wheels. Actually, the stock wheels and tires, this is what they look like. They blow off the rim, um, don't get me wrong, the rim looks pretty cool, but these tires are like toy wheels and they suck. So um, they're not good for them all. They don't look like monster truck tires, they look like you got a Walmart RC. So uh, we went and got some Pro-Line Master tires for it. Also to go with the Pro-Line Master tires, we got aluminum hexes so we didn't strip our brand new tires out, which are Traxxas aluminum hexes. Yep, there's the part number there and there. You can probably take a picture of that or zoom in. Um, just recently I rebuilt the entire RC car. Everything's nice and clean. We also outfitted it with Proline um, Power Stroke front shocks, the adjustable ones, and Tra and Traxxas Big Bore shocks in the rear. Now this gives it a nice durability upgrade as well, smoother suspension. This thing feels very, very nice. It does not slap the ground. It, um, it just is a very nice ride. A little bit stiff, but um, we go over quite a bit of jumps with it. It's got a nice big suspension travel on there. We also put a Savix high torque steel servo in there, so that means the steering is quite a bit better from stock. I would say twice as good. It's much more durable. Savix is probably, in my opinion, the best servos to get. Um, we had to zip tie the Willy bar, which is one of our major issues. The Willy bar kept falling off, um, so we just zip tied it in one position. The Traxxas wheelie bars, they suck because they keep flopping all over the place. It's very, very annoying. Um, we have not yet upgraded the axles, although we have broke like four of them. Um, that will be a distant upgrade in the future. We decided to put a fan on this, a custom fan under the computer actually. And we, um, we zip tied it over there on top of the motor to keep it cool because we upgraded the gearing to the accessory pinion gear, which makes it go a little bit more top speed. Um, other than that, we really don't have any upgrades on it. It's uh, box stock, other than the tires, the hexes, the shocks, and um, a little fan we added there. We also, since the, the, the body it came with was pretty cool, don't get me wrong, but we decided to go with something a little bit more old school monster truck style. We got a Chevrolet um, truck body right here, old school, nice doomsday looking red paint job. Um, I did that myself, actually. This is probably one of my best paint jobs I did. It's beat up, but it's uh, it's as tough as a rock, and um, it fits really nice on this car. It looks really good, and um, the body cutouts work pretty good with these tires, and it just really looks mean with these tires and the body. So, uh, anyways, guys, I was just showing you what we did to our stampede over here. I'll give you a full review probably after this video of it. Um, it will be coming up a complete full review of this RC car. Also, some more videos of this RC car in action will be coming up. Other than that, we are working on making a monster slash. So, they, we're going to make a two-wheel drive slash with stampede tires and a brushless motor system as well as a new body. And uh, we're going to go see uh, how that does and do some videos on that as well. So, uh, anyways, guys, thank you for watching the video. And uh, if you have any questions, shoot me up on Instagram under nonstop underscore RC underscore YouTube and I'll uh, be sure to get back to you within uh, within a day. Thank you guys and see you next time on Nonstop RC.